Welcome back to another 40 Runners, folks. Today is a little bit different of a video that I've ever done on the channel before. And it's something that I've wanted to do for a while now, and that's product review videos. If you're anything like me, I uh, spend a lot of time on YouTube watching other people share their experiences with product that they've got in and, uh, or purchased. And it's always, I mean, before I go ahead and buy something at the store, I like to go on YouTube and hear other people's thoughts and opinions and uh, see their hands-on experience with that product. That's what I'm doing here. And uh, without further ado, I'd like to showcase uh, this backpack. It was sent to me by a company called New View Hunting. This is their 35 liter backpack. So yeah, one of the most important pieces of gear you can bring out hunting with you is the backpack, you guys. Um, besides your bow and your gun, um, your weapon, uh, one of the things you don't want to leave home with when you go out hunting is a backpack. The backpack, you're gonna be able to put uh, all your gear in. In my case, I put all my uh, camera equipment in here, all my hunting gear, you know, calls, ammunition, uh, also your lunch. <laughs> Um, so you can be out in the woods longer and hunt longer and uh, be more successful. All right, let's dive into some of the things that this backpack has to offer. The backpack is made up of uh, water resistant nylon, which makes it really durable and just helps the backpack itself to last longer. A nice thing about this backpack is you're able to uh, strap in your bow or your gun with it. Um, so your hands could be free, makes just for easier travel out in the field. One thing I'm noticing just looking at this backpack is um, it's got these cool elastic cords here, which you know could just help with stores and strapping things down. Um, on the side here, we have straps. I mean, you could put something in this pocket, I don't know, a large bottle of water or something and strap it down so it isn't gonna be moving around. All the zippers are water resistant. If you look in close here, you can see that there's a, like a rubber lining that sticks really close to where the zipper would be. That's gonna make your zippers uh, water resistant. Comes with this real nice uh, portable handle. But yeah, with this uh, nice handle on here and this rub piece of rubber, it's really gonna come in handy when you're in the deer stand and you wanna hanging on that hook, you know that this thing ain't gonna be falling. All right, moving on to the main compartment of the bag. This would be where I would probably store most of my camera gear um, and whatnot. Plenty of room to put a camera in there, binoculars, you name it. Whatever, that, whatever uh, suits you and whatever you like to bring along hunting, um, there's a, definitely more than enough room in the the main compartment here. Another nice feature of this bag is um, it's compatible with most uh, hydration packs. Also on the main compartment is another little pocket here. So you could, could throw whatever you want in that little pocket. Yeah, just looking at the bag, it looks like it has a middle pocket and a front pocket. Uh, we're gonna check out the middle pocket here. All right, so you kind of got to unclip this top strap to get this middle pocket all the way open. That opens up nice and big. I like that. So yeah, in this middle pocket, you got a back pocket here, a zipper pocket, looks like a little mesh pocket, and then looks like you, you, got, you could put a pen or a pencil, maybe a, a little knife also in here and then we have the front pocket that's pretty deep look at that that goes all the way up almost to my elbow that's really nice there's nothing no other pockets inside that front pocket just open space which is nice you got um, pockets on the side here on both sides Got some D loops right here. D loops are nice. You could hang, you know, your uh, rangefinder off of there and whatnot. 
Um, you also got these loops here you can put carabiners on. Adjustable straps all over this thing so it's gonna um, fit nice and comfy when it's on your back. I haven't had a backpack that has had these but it's got this waist waist belt on here on both sides. So that opens up and that goes around your waist and actually on each side of the waist belt you have pockets so you could put a little actually if you wanted you could put a little sidearm in there. You got clips here that you can unclip and it opens up and there's even more loops that you could put more carabiners on or stuff whatever you want or hook on anything that you else that you could need. All right, another nice uh, feature about this bag that New View has thought of is they give you the option of putting a steel piece in there for extra support. And what you do is you take this piece right here and you spread this open. Your plastic piece mounted in your steel frame and there's this little kind of notch thing at the top. You want to make sure that's the top at the top of your bag when you're sliding this in. So yeah, that steel frame just fits right in there and it just adds some added support. I can already tell it's made this backpack a little more rigid. That's really clever. Noticing is that like a reflector? So if you lose your backpack at night, you can almost take a flashlight and then shine around till you see this thing shimmer and you'll be able to find your backpack if you misplaced it. We got the rain cover here. Um, this would be if you're caught in a torrential downpour or something, you can um, put this over your backpack and it's gonna keep everything on the inside dry. And also being that it's you know, kind of like a blaze orange. I believe in certain situations, you know, I don't know, state by state, they might require you to have a blaze orange f flag in your bag. Um, so yeah, this could come in handy if you're, you're out on a rainy day. On the bottom of the bag, you got a couple more straps here, and then you can hang or, you know, roll up an extra jacket or whatever and just stuff it right in here. I can't wait to load this up with my gear and see how it feels. All in all, you guys, I, this backpack has my approval. It's not incredibly huge. Like I said, it's 35 um, liter backpack. And this will probably be my go-to backpack in the upcoming uh, hunting season. It's gonna fit all the gear that I need um, to be effective out in the woods. One thing I wish that the bag did have, I mean, no bag's ever gonna be perfect. And one addition I think that would be nice is I know we have these side pockets here um, that are open, but it would, I feel it would be nice to just have a little on above that or below it, maybe a zipper pocket on each side where you can fit a few extra things. I know there's a lot of things in my bag, calls, a knife, flashlight, extra batteries, ammo, um, face paint, whatnot, everything that we need out in the woods, you guys. Um, and I feel like just maybe two extra pockets on this would just, would sweeten it a little more. So all in all, this is a wonderful backpack. I'm excited to run it this fall. If you're, uh, you know, on the fence about getting a backpack, just a mid range backpack, I would highly recommend this new view hunting bag. And, uh, you guys can go to, um, newviewhunting.com and also you can get an additional 15% off when you use 40 runners 15 at checkout. So yeah, don't forget to use 40 runners 15 at checkout. I'll have a link to a uh, new view and they have all sorts of stuff on there, hunting suits, um, backpacks, they got women's and men's clothes. Yeah, go on there and just explore what they have to offer. It's a great company. If I had to compare it to any kind of company that's already out there on the web, um, I've bought in Tight Wee stuff before and I feel this is very um, comparable to that. And honestly, if more, I 
feel like more people should give New View a chance because not only do they make a good bag, but they're just a great company in general. But yeah, I'm hoping this video wasn't too long and I hope it helped you guys um, make a decision on a backpack for this upcoming hunting season. If you enjoyed this kind of a video, please let me know. This is the first time I've done it on the channel. I feel like my uh, feet are a little shaky with it. Um, but it was nice to wet my beak. I'm hoping to do more of this kind of stuff. So if you enjoyed it, please hit that uh, like button or leave me a comment. And also if you're not subscribed yet, which I know many of you are not, um, I look at the analytics. I gotta say there's about 98% of you that are not subscribed to the channel. Please subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.